All right, so what I got here today is a new Baofeng BF-F9 version 2 plus. I'm going to go through this real quick because I started to go through this with a different radio that I had a failure on. So let's just go through this real quick and see if this has got all the pieces. <laughs> uh, manual, the battery, okay here's the radio. Uh, the previous radio was missing one of these trim pieces. This appears to have both of them. Antenna. There's the earpiece, the wrist strap, the charger wall wart, there's the uh, belt clip, and the charger base. So everything appears to be here. Let's pop this guy open, take a look at him a little closer. Let me zoom in. Alright, so here we have the Bayo Fang. Um, put it side by side here with the other uh, 8 watt Bayo Fang I have. And yeah, like I say, about size, about the same, keypads about the same. You know, they did some chrome stuff, made the screen look a little bit different. But probably all in all, it's very similar. Now this, if you read their website, this is based upon the UV5R. They have just uh, did some enhancements to the firmware and of course gave it the uh, 8 watt power. So the first thing I'm going to do is just take a look. I'm going to zoom out. Let's see if the UV5R extended battery works. And sure enough, now mine's come apart. I've dropped it a few times. That's that's not a function of the radio. That's <laughs> that's me. So the extended battery seems to work. Color matches fairly well. This is the new Nagoya antenna. That's supposed to be for these. And what do you know? They actually fit a little better. Um, let me show you the other Nagoya antenna, and I'll show you a problem I had with it that I didn't like. Now, what I usually do is stick a little piece of a little piece of rubber in there, but it leaves a pretty good sized gap. The new Nagoya seems to fit just a little bit better. A teeny tiny little gap, but not very much. And of course the, the external speaker mic snaps in just fine. All right, so there you have it. Uh, the new Bofang um, BFF9 version 2 plus definitely works with all of the existing UV5R accoutrements. Here's the original battery. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna charge this bad boy up, and then once it gets charged up, we'll uh, see about programming it, and then, uh, and then maybe do some power testing. That's it for this video, thanks for watching.